here guys, what's up? Today we are in front of this absolutely stunning Aston Martin Vanquish, which was built as a tribute to the Aston Martin from Die Another Day and to 007. My name's Marcus and you're watching Roads, Roads Untraveled. So here we are inside the Vanquish. Now this is my first time ever sitting in an Aston Martin. Um, I sat in a Ferrari 488 and that was the first Ferrari I sat in. Now comparing th that to this, this is a lot more about kind of the luxuries inside. Now of course the Vanquish design is about 10 years old at this point. So some of the stuff is a little dated, but I mean, it holds up really well. All the materials are perfect. You've got the real carbon fiber door inserts. You've got the carbon fiber dash in the center here. All these buttons, very simple. We reviewed a Hyundai Genesis not too long ago, and of course they kind of copied Aston Martin's badge, but I mean, this is the real deal here. So the Vanquish is a nice place to be, but it's not really an Aston Martin, at least not on a technical level. The reason it feels dated is because it's built on a new edge Ford Mustang platform and is powered by a supercharged 4.6 liter V8 as it was in the movie. All the body panels are Aston Martin, but once you step inside, the fantasy is faded by the Mustang steering wheel and gauges, despite being closely modeled after the Vanquish interior. Even still, it's a unique and exclusive piece of work that has its merits. And then as far as features go, just to this car, or the, um, the 50 Spy Car editions that were built, you've got the controls that come out there, and you've got the buttons for the rockets, so we can put up and down, you'll see that. And we have a little surprise for our passenger, which is great. Now they can enjoy a nice beverage on the drive to wherever the heck you're going. Um, and I mean, this is the road trip car. Out of all the cars we've ever driven on the channel, this is the one I would want to take on a road trip. These seats are perfect. The driving position is perfect. And visibility is great. I mean, the A pillars are a little bit large, uh, but other than that, the, this car is just full of style. It's designed first and foremost, and that's what Aston Martin is known for. 